Hello, I'm Daniele Clary, Software Architect at Aeon Europe. With this video, I'm going to show you how to set up Hilo 8 AI acceleration module with our AppSquare Pro, a single board computer of the App series from Aeon. You can find the necessary setup instructions for Hilo 8 on a dedicated page from the App Community Wiki. On this page, there are also other relevant links about this AI accelerator, compatibility with our platforms, and so on. Hilo 8 AI Acceleration Module is a powerful M.2 module to perform AI inferencing on edge devices. You can find more details about the product, the technology, and useful resources on the Hilo website. Getting back to our wiki page, we move now to the Getting Started Guide section. After assembling the Hilo 8 module on the M.2 2280 slot of our board, as shown on the picture, you will need to set up your system with Ubuntu Linux OS as described in the linked tutorial. You can now boot up your board with the operating system installed. Before starting the setup, Open the terminal to install some required dependencies like DKMS and Linux kernel headers. Wait till the end of the process and reboot the system before proceeding further. Once rebooted, open the available web browser and visit the download section of the app community. From here, you can find the Hilo 8 setup package. Please download the necessary files to proceed with the software installation. You can find a direct link to this download page from the Getting Started Guide. Open a terminal and change the folder to where the files have been downloaded. The first step is to enable executable permission to the prerequisite setup file. Then you can execute the script to start the installation. This process will install Docker, Docker Compose and its dependencies after adding the official repository to the system. It will then install the Hilo 8 PCA driver as DKMS module and then extract the Hilo 8 tapas files to a dedicated directory in your home folder. At the end of the setup process, you will be prompt to reboot the system before proceeding to the Tapas container first setup.
After rebooting, open the terminal and go into the newly created ILO folder, where you can run the script to launch the Tapas container. During the first run, you will need to provide also additional setup parameters as shown here. You will be prompted directly into the container terminal at the end of the setup process. You can exit anytime and for resuming an existing container, also after reboot, you can use the following command. Now choose one of the available examples, changing directory to the specific folder and executing the example script. In this case, we are going to execute an object detection application based on the YOLO v5 model. Once the application is running, you can see the output video with the object detection on your screen. The sample application's documentation is available as PDF in the ILO folder alongside the container setup script. You can download the ILO 8 model zoo from the link in our wiki where you will find pre-compiled and optimized models for further evaluation and development of your applications. You can subscribe to the App Community Forum for any question you might have on our products. Thanks for watching the video.